hello guys welcome back once again to the more satellite it's been a while if i've come your way with videos and today's video uh a lot of you guys are still confused or are still not okay or uh, how to navigate through this decoder this is what hd plus decoder this is hd plus decoder so some of you call me and they ask me what are the functions that it has it has a lot of functions it has a lot of functions if uh, one function it has it it has sd and then what hd the hd channels are very clear very very clear crystal clear if i say clear very 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 clear than the sd channels but although they are all the same channels and then the function the other function that it has again is it has some channels which are on the hd side which cannot be found or which you can't find in the sd column example like cool tv DGN, Al Jazeera, Foresight TV, and then uh, uh, Cine, Africa, Africa Cine. A lot of them are on the digital side, uh, on the AD side, which cannot be found at the SD side. And today I'm here, and then other function it also has it. You can watch these same channels on your phone. You can watch these same channels on your phone yourself, including other uh, other four or three of your family members. So today. The, the the video is just mainly going to be about the functions it has and then it also has to what upload or the upload my your software manually sometimes the decoder don't need a do need software so right now before you upload you make sure that you have a pen drive which is empty the pen drive should be empty it should be totally empty it shouldn't contain anything any any song or any other software that is where you put only the uh, only the my HD plus my HD plus decoder software into it. So after getting your flash drive, which is the pen drive, and then putting in your software, you now go you now come to the DC. That is when you want to update it manually because most most of the decoders uh, are there. Uh, the 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 DC comes manually. The software is done man is done automatic. But when you own your uh, the, your decoder, then you see that. The decoder needs a manual software upgrade. You will need your uh, your pen drive where you have your software in it. So right now, I'm going to show you guys how you what how you run your software onto this decoder manually, manually. So let's go onto the screen or let's let's go onto the screen so that I'll take you guys through how to what upload the software into it manually when we are done i'll come and show you guys how to navigate through the decoder uh, those simple steps that you don't know of that i'll that i worry you i'll show you how to what navigate through because some are there some people do call me that please i've, I've on my ad plus decoder and then i can only see my what my ad plus channels the, my other normal channels my the other normal sd channels i can't find them so right now before I teach you how to what navigate through the that one, I'm going to show you how you what you run your software manually on this HD Plus decoder. So guys, without saying much, I think we'll go onto the television or let's go to the decoder so that I'll take you guys through how to what upload the software manually. And then mind you, I said this pen drive should contain only the SD, only the software for the hd uh, hd plus it should contain only the software it shouldn't contain any other what software or any other thing and no music nothing it should contain only the software before you can be able to what run it in the decoder so let's go to the decoder and i'll take you guys through so before you upload so right now i'm putting in the software i'm putting in my pen drive i'm putting in my pen drive I've taken you take off the power you can see that the power is now what off you take off the power and then what you insert your pen drive where the decoder is you can see the software the pen drive is a setting point is here you insert the pen drive in it and then after putting in your your pen drive after putting in your pen drive you now what make sure that you now make sure that you hold the power when you put in your pen drive when you put in your pen drive make sure that you press and hold hold still the power button 
on the on the decoder. Hold it. Don't leave it. When you hold it this way, don't leave it. Just hold it still. And then what? Put on. Put in the. Uh, put put in your power source. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm not, I'm what? I'm pressing it still. I'm not release it. I'm pressing it still. And then I what? Put in my power source. So watch what to, watch what to high appear on the television. So you can see, you don't leave it after it start this way. You don't leave it. You hold you you hold still till it's done. What uploading the software into the decoder. So this is the manual where you can upload your software in the decoder. So as you can see, it's saying that don't power it off. Please don't power it off. When you do so, you damage the decoder. So let's wait till it finishes, and then we'll see what will happen. So it's still uploading the software. So this is the what? Manual uploading of software into the decoder. This is what? Manual. If you own your data, then you see that it doesn't do the automatic upload. You don't need what? So right now, it's done. Now let's wait and see if it will on again. Right? You see? It's going for the second round. And then at that point, you, you can now what? Leave the power button to, for it to finish the uploading. So let's wait and see how it's going to end. So right now it's saying that upgrade complete. So after the upgrading, it will what? It will come back on again. It will it will power itself off and then come back on again. So let's wait for it to come back, for it to boot again, and then we'll see how it. So this is it. It's not coming back on again. So right now, as before, I as it as as it boots, you may ask. Uh, somebody might ask, or you might be wondering, why will you, why or why should you buy this decoder? For me, I say, when you have keys, one one function it has is when you have keys, so you can see, it's telling me that I should what do automatic upgrade. So when this is where you do the what the automatic what update, the automatic update, it will send the decoder off just the same way and then come back on again now this is the automatic upgrade that one too you don't power it off when you make a mistake and then you power the decoder off you've damaged the decoder So as it as it's uh, it's, it's, it's doing the up, uh, the upgrade, let's uh, you. I was saying that why why would you or why should you or why will I advise you to buy this decoder? Okay, I'll advise you to buy this decoder because if you have kids, if you have kids who love cartoons, you have two cartoon channels on it, which the children are going to love. And then if you have somebody to who love at the news, you have Al Jazeera operating on it. And if you are somebody who loves music, you have your music channels on it. And if you are somebody who love, who love this the uh, who love movies, you have movie channels also on there. So guys, so this is it. This is it. So this is one of the functions, or one of the functions that to me I will go in for HD plus decoder. And the one one thing I like about I love about it is I love how clear how clear the channels are. The channels are very, very clear when, when, when you are watching. Very, very, very clear when you are watching. So, guys, so the function I said again is you can watch it on your phone with your loved ones. You, you can share you, you can share your your account with three or four of your family members for them to also watch, enjoy on their phones. For them to also watch, 
enjoy on the phone. So in the app, you go to Play Store, download their app. You download their app on Play Store, and then I'll show you where you be. I'll show you where you get your HD Plus number, and then the HD Plus pin code. So right now it's done with. We are done with the automatic upgrade as you are. It will go off, and then what? Power itself back on again. So at that point, you cannot what take off your pen drive and wait for it to come on. So as we as, as we wait for it to come on, so that we will see how the channels are going to be like. So this is it. This is how the interface is. Very fine interface.